Beauty and Monster A traveler was donkeying through a deserted place. He saw a big fort. He had been traveling continuously for several days. That's why I was very tired. He thought of stopping in the fort and taking rest for a while. When he reached inside the fort, he saw that all the lights there were lit. The entire fort was glowing. There was a big table there. There was delicious food on it. The traveler looked around. He did not see anyone. He was very hungry. So he sat down to eat alone. This fort belonged to a demon. This monster was very scary to see. But he was very good at heart. There were all the facilities in his fort for the traveling travelers, whoever wanted could stay there. But he himself never appeared in front of anyone, because as soon as they saw him everyone would run away in fear. The traveler had a full meal and slept there. When he woke up in the morning, he picked up his things and left. He saw that there were many beautiful roses growing in the garden outside. The traveler thought of buying a flower for his daughter. As soon as he extended his hand to pluck the flower, suddenly that monster came there. The demon loved his flowers very much. He did not like it at all if anyone broke them. The demon said loudly, You ate your fill, sleep comfortably. I liked it. But you have tried to pluck my flowers. I cannot bear this at all. Now you will definitely be punished for this, you will have to stay here. Forever. The traveler apologized to the demon and told him that he was taking this flower for his daughter. Then the demon said, I can release you on one condition, you will have to leave here and send your daughter here. The traveler had no other way to save himself. So he promised to send his daughter, Sundarya, and went to his home. He told the whole story to Sundarya. Sundarya was a brave girl. She agreed to go. When she reached the fort, she also saw the same thing that her father had seen. She ate food and slept. The next day he went to the rooms of the fort and looked, but he did not see anyone. He searched everywhere outside the fort, but no one was there. Many days donkeyed like this. When the demon saw that Sundaria was living comfortably there, he understood that she was a brave girl. That's why he came before him, to meet him. Sundaria was told about the demon by her father. That's why she wasn't nervous at all. She knew that the monster was very kind and good. When the demon saw Sundarya, he fell in love with her. But he knew that beauty could never love him because of his scary shape. Both of them used to eat together. Then the demon would go away. The demon kept feeling sad in his heart. But couldn't say anything. Gradually he became so sad that he fell ill. One day when he came to eat, he fell on the floor due to weakness. Sundarya ran and placed his head in her lap and started caressing it. Tears welled up in his eyes. One of her tears fell on the demon and then a miracle happened. The monster turned into a very handsome young man. Both of them started liking each other. Sundarya and that young man got married. He lived a happy life. The End Please hit the like button if you like this video, and hit the subscribe button to watch new interesting stories every day.
Thank you so much for watching this video till the end.